from the local station. News 4 Jax starts now. Tonight, a local middle school football team undefeated for the season will not play in their biggest game this year. Parents and players at Revolt Middle School just found out their playoff dreams are over. They tell us the opposing team discovered that a player on their team is over age and they've been disqualified from the semifinals. News for Jack's reporter Tara Lagerman joins us live from Revolt Middle School, uh, where the game was supposed to be kicking off in just 30 minutes. Oh, man, how disappointing is this? Uh, this was supposed to be their big night, and instead they are not playing this evening. If you take a look behind me, you can see that the lights at the stadium are off. There are no parents and students filing in to cheer on their team. In fact, everything is all quiet. And parents and students tell me that they are just stunned that their undefeated season ended this way. They also tell me that this overage player is the son of one of the coaches. I'm feeling a little pissed about the whole situation. Um, I don't think it's fair to punish the whole team over one technical error. Natasha Hansel can't believe her sixth grade son Jeremiah's undefeated football season at Rebalt Middle School is over. The season was forfeited because there was one player that was over age. Um, he turned 15 in May. According to Duval County Middle School sports guidelines, athletes cannot turn 15 before September 1st or the student becomes permanently ineligible. Hansel says the student has been on the team all season. She heard the heartbreaking news when Jeremiah called her after school. Doesn't matter the, um, the coach whose son it was. He tells us the overage player is the son of one of the assistant coaches and his head coach told the players at practice on Tuesday. It was like bad news um, that we got disqualified from out the um, championship and we had to pack up our stuff. So instead of Rebalt Middle playing Mayport Middle, it will now be Mayport versus Mandarin. This message was posted on the school website on game day early Wednesday morning. It shouldn't forfeit everything that they worked so hard for. It's not fair. Now, I have reached out to Revolt Middle School Administration as well as the Duval County Public Schools for comment. The District AD Tammy Talley did text me back confirming that the team did have an ineligible player, which caused them to be disqualified from the playoffs. She directed me to the communications department for more information, and so far I have not heard back from them. Now, parents tell me that another controversy that all of this has stirred up is that the runner-up from the North Region, Highlands Middle, will not be playing Mayport Middle tonight, that spot was instead given to the South Region leader, Mandarin Middle School. Live at Rebot Middle School tonight, Tara Lagerman, Channel 4, The Local Station.